Most 50,000 Americans will be diagnosed with pancreatic cancer this year, and for most it means they only have months to live. But a cancer research center in downtown Phoenix is hoping to change this deadly trend. ABC 15 Mornings anchor Dan Spindle has the story. Jennifer Harper is known as the fish lady, and seven days a week you'll find her here, tending to hundreds of zebra fish. They've got perfect lighting, fresh filters, and not just flake food either. These fish eat brine shrimp and algae-consuming rotifers. I want to make sure these fish are happy if I put it in a nutshell. But this isn't some kind of a fancy pet store. Jennifer is part of a team at TGen working to fight pancreatic cancer. Whatever research we do in the lab, we always looking to help patients. Dr. Han told me that late diagnosis is the main killer as the cancer spreads to other organs. Researchers at this nonprofit believe the answer for pancreatic cancer patients might be right here in this petri dish. I know what you're thinking. What is with fish for cancer research? Well, these little guys known as fry fish, baby zebra fish, they actually have bones and organs that develop kind of like humans, and their genetic code almost matches ours, so they're great for research and you can see right through them. It's a lot more efficient to use a zebra fish as a model compared to like mice or sheep or monkeys. TGen's advances have produced medications that mean extra months for patients. The goal, to add quality years to their lives. We're making progress, and especially the progress is coming out of TGen. This team won't rest until they find the answer swimming beneath the surface. In downtown Phoenix, I'm Dan Spindle, ABC 15 News.